This is an overlooked rhino feature, distance, angle, and ortho constraint. Using distance constraint, you can specify a point by typing a distance and pressing space. And as you move the cursor in any direction, the distance from the last point will be constrained to that distance. Let's give this a try. We go up to curve, we choose polyline, let's go to zero, zero, and there's our line rubber banded out. Let's type in 11 on the command line, then space. Now if you look, we've got a line 11 units long, it's black, and then we've got a white rubber band off of that. And we can draw this line any angle that we want. Let's just choose it here. Using angle constraint, you can specify an angle by typing a less than sign, followed by a value and pressing space. The next point is constrained to lines at multiples of the angle relative to the x-axis you specified. So let's try it at 45. So we're going to do the less than sign on the command line, and then type in 45 and then space. Now as we rubber band around you notice that we're jumping in 45 degree increments. Now if you have ortho turned off on your object snaps you can toggle it by holding the shift key down. So I'm going to hold the shift down and you notice that now ortho is on. And we'll pick a line. And you you can mix and match ortho constraints to fit your needs. Let's say we want to do a line that's five units long. We'll type in five and at 45 degrees. We'll type in less than 45 and then space. Now if you notice we're rubber banding 45 degrees at five units. We'll click space. One interesting thing that most people miss is that you can mix and the distance, angle, and ortho constraints and use them with other commands like moving or copying. So let's pick this item and let's go to copy and we'll pick from the base point. And if you notice normal copy just drags it around. But let's make a copy that's nine units away, nine in space, and 45 degrees, less than 45. Now if you've noticed we're jumping in those increments. If we want to make another copy, we could hold down the shift key and we would jump into ortho mode. We'll just go straight down the ortho. This is Robert Schutz. Thank you.